Welcome to Good Mythical More. Superpower. We're a couple of superheroes. Yeah. Our names are Mr. Cocoa Butter and Sloth Boy. <laughs> I'm Mr. Cocoa Butter. I'm smooth. Hi, I'm Sloth Boy. The way we work together is I come in and I rub you down. <laughs> and you get taken off guard and you get all relaxed and that allows Sloth Boy to do what he does, which is punch you very, very slowly. In the face. Sloth Boy doesn't work for, very well without the co cocoa butter to come in and smooth things over first. They're slipping away. That was the only funny thing in that, um, that Zootopia movie was the sloth. And it was in the it was in the trailer, you know, and Ooh, I was like, harsh diss. When it got to that point, we got Zootopia I like, fans. I was like, man, that is a funny part. If I hadn't already seen it in the trailer, Zach's very upset. His here was a fine movie. I think he's running a fever. What? Are you okay, Zach? You've been like, like you you honked your nose so hard, it's like a river came out. No, he would. <laughs> Should you even be here, man? No, no, you know what? Two days ago, I, I looked over there at him, and he looked like death. I think. I mean, it, he's he, a little better yeah, now. He's gotten better. But is this going in the episode? What? <laughs> <laughs> Who's gonna get it? Who's gonna get it? I mean, I've been keeping my distance. I'll put my nose down in this stuff, but I can't go near Zach. <laughs> <laughs> you can hear it hit the bottom of the Kleenex. Oh wow! Um, I hope you get better, man. I think you're no, on no, the mend. No, I think he's. I think he is better. Right. Once you're once you're passing that much stuff, yeah, that's, that's a good sign. You're on the come down. Right. You're landing. What do we got? We got some other stuff to explore. Um, it still smells like the bottom of a dumpster in the, here. The main thing is just the fermentation of the shamrock shake. The dairy product nature of things. Which apparently you can't smell, which is concerning on many levels as I've already established. I, I'm just wondering, am I, am I cutting my nose hairs too hard? I don't think you smell with the nose hairs first. But, but I think I'm like, I have one of those zzz, and I'm just like zzzing so hard that I've taken away my like my nose buds. I did notice that my nose hairs are back after having. Well, of course they come back in like four days at our age. Taking them completely out at, at uh, Shay Mitchell's house. Okay, so this, yeah, well, dude, that was a long time ago. I mean, you freaking. Four days later, you had a forest again. It's, four days? No, uh, when you take the follicle out, it takes a while for it to come back, and I. I really want you, you're it. due for a trim. I could tell, especially the, the left one. I know, I can look ben right there. Then just put a air freshener on the back of that monitor right there. Here, this is a Big Mac um, that hasn't been sitting in a shamrock shake and whiskey together. Well, no, we have one of each, right? For a month. I, I need to sneeze. Uh, Do you can want I have one of your? Can I have one of your handkerchiefs? There you go. No, I don't want to touch it. I don't want to touch your. Here's a towel with some brown stuff on it. <laughs> Um, I, I feel like I need to sneeze. Uh, and also bow out. Um, so, we don't have any choices for this, but we can just sort of talk amongst ourselves as to what we think happened to the Big Mac. I think the Big Mac and the uh, whiskey expanded. It stayed, I think, yeah, I think that the entire jar is just gonna just, be a, just a Big Mac just that's a just big formed Mac. to yeah, the yeah, right. jar. Well, the and bread I, part, at least. There's three buns, there's a lot of bun in a Big Mac. I, how much uh, pressure do you think that it built up in the Shamrock Shake? I say none, because of the, again, because of the McDonald's preservation techniques. Well, but there's, I think there's pressure just in the, just in the Shamrock Shake itself. I'd say a little bit of pressure, a wee, a wee bit of pressure. Let's find out, oh wow. Well, first of all, look at that. We're right about the Big Mac in the whiskey. It has just expanded in the whiskey. It has filled basically the thing. I wonder how it tastes. It, and it flipped to the side though. And this Big Mac has turned into green cottage cheese. What would happen if you consumed that? Let's open this one. Okay. And let's see if we can, can we, can we get it out and see if we can like, yeah, we can get it out. What are y'all talking about over there? Is there a you message for us? What Alex and I have agreed that's what our stomachs look like on the weekend. <laughs> yeah. You eat Big just, Macs whole? Just a yeah. bloated Big Mac. <laughs> 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 you better stay out of Stevie's way. Don't judge me in Stevie's weekend. <laughs> <laughs> We've been snorting Big Macs again. I mean, even if you look 
even if you look down the barrel of that, even the cheese is like perfectly intact. Yeah, it's, it's you know, only the best. I mean, I think it's gonna come apart if I take it out, but I'll do it. See if we can keep it intact and pull it out. It smells good. It smells sweet. I like, I like, Jam you like Jameson? <laughs> I don't know. I think that Jameson is one of my favorite whiskeys. I know it's it's not like a fancy whiskey. Be gentle, be gentle. But it's, a, it's an Irish okay. whiskey. And they drank it in that first season of True Detective. Oh, you're missing the, hold on, you're missing the bottom. Missing I'll get the, the bottom, I'll come back. You're missing the bottom bun. Matthew McConaughey's character drank it in True Detective season one. And that advertising really worked for me because anything MM drinks. That, that's a fail. Yeah, I'm sorry. Okay, so that didn't come out. I'm gonna put this on there so we don't spill it. Now, it doesn't smell bad though. There's a, we know, didn't get to do any dissecting in the show, so. Look at that. It's kind of what you would expect though, you know. The real taste, the real challenge is if you taste a little taste of it. I mean, it literally smells like a Big Mac and whiskey. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Kiss it. Kiss it. I know you're in just in a bad mood, and you're trying because <laughs> Ben is like the most sensitive to smells. You're like the opposite of me. Like I think you've Hold sucked on, on my smelling well, no, ability. You, you are very, t very sensitive to smell, typically, which is why I I'm thought I was too. Which is why I'm concerned. Like the the putrefaction of. Like sometimes you come into the office and you're like, did you have lunch in here three days ago? Like it's like that level of precision. And I don't know what it is, maybe it's just fermented shamrock shake. I think you've smelled too much. I think it's like an elephant's molars. I think that you've been using your nose too hard and your your nose is dying at yeah, age I can 40. I can smell that though, that's bad. Ugh! What is that? That's a Big Mac? Yeah, that's just another Big Mac. Uh, let's move on to something else, man. Let's just not close let, that back up. We don't hey, need to go down that road again. You don't want to pull that one out? No. You don't want us to pull this one out? Nope. What else do we have? Oh, gosh. <sighs> gosh. Okay. So over here we have a shameless merch plug. We put we put our own shirt, one of the Apocalypse shirts, um, inside of a Shamrock Shake for a month. Well, I think it probably turned a little green. No, no, it's a big jar. It's pressurized. Listen. Wow. Oh. That's a lot of shake. Whole lot of shaking going on. A lot of pressure. We're gonna pull this out. My stomach is starting to tensify. Oh, really? Who wants it? <laughs> Let's see how oh it gosh. It's like a form of tie dye. Here's the front. Ugh. I'm not sure it's worth it. Look at oh, it. It's just, it, it doesn't, you know what? It smells better than everything else we put in there. Look, it actually, did it, it turned parts of it green. Look at that. But look how well that graphic held up. <laughs> <laughs> That's quality. <laughs> Mythical dot store. Now, I think we can launder this, and this is, can be part of the process. We call it shamrocked. We've shamrocked it. Would you, do you want your shirt shamrocked? Yes. I don't, it's gonna be difficult if we have to do it for every shirt for a month in a jar. <laughs> We're gonna fill the shelves up pretty fast. It's, a new, it's the new form of tie-dye. Okay, and uh, we have anything <sighs> else? Oh, gosh. Okay, we, oh. Have, we have a red sock that was left in whiskey. A red sock? Get it? Boston. 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 That's how we say Boston. I don't get it, man. What do you think happened to a red sock? You still don't get it? Boston. Boston Red Sox. Boston Red Sox. <laughs> <laughs> Boston has a lot of Irish people. Never been there. <laughs> yep. That seems like a just a, an offensive generalization. Uh, and no, saying Irish people only wear red socks 
That, which is also true. I mean, <laughs> let's face it. Well, we're, we're, we're Irish. Yeah, I've I'm, I'm got a lot of Irish in me. Look I can that. make fun of them all I want. Look at that, the whiskey has turned red, I believe. It's kind of hard to tell. I think you got to take that Boston Red Sox out of there. And we're gonna, do we get a foot massage? I can't remember. Yeah, we want a foot yes, massage. Yes, we get a foot massage on Instagram. So go over, make sure you check that out. Now that's some. I tell you, people in Boston would buy that. If you tell them. <laughs> red they're, Sox. They're, we, got, we got Red Sox. Whiskey. Red Sox whiskey. Red Sox whiskey. And they're like, yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, you didn't put a Red Sox in there for, 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 you put a Red Sox in there for a month. <laughs> if you talk really fast, we'll be able to figure out I can't really do a Boston accent. Uh, you had a Red Sox whiskey? Squeeze that into your mouth. Uh, I'll squeeze it in your mouth. <laughs> yes, I'll not. squeeze it onto our shirt, and we can we we we've, we've shaked it. Shamrock and red socked and red socked. Shamrock and red socked. Mythical dot store. Eighty nine dollars. <laughs> we've got your arms covered with our logo long sleeves. Choose from zip ups, crew necks, and pullovers. Available now at mythical dot store.